warmly for receiving the Nobel Prize of Medicine and Physiology today. So I initially thought it was a joke actually, that it was my research group who made an elaborate joke. Uh, but then it sounded a little too convincing, so... But it was hard to digest actually, immediately. I think the thing that is amazing to me is that we now have some ability to go back in time and actually follow genetic history and genetic changes over time. What really drives our work is really curiosity, I would say. It is just as if you do an archaeological excavation to find out about the past, we sort of make excavations in the human genome. But there might come practical implications out of that. I mean, we have discovered, for example, that in the COVID pandemic, the greatest risk factor to become severely ill and even die when you're infected with the virus has come over to modern people from Neanderthals. So we, we and others are now intensely studying the Neanderthal version versus the protective modern version to try to understand what the functional difference would be. And if we understood that, we could perhaps also treat COVID better.